This is problem number 78 on the 2012 AP Calculus exam. The graph of y equals e to the tangent of x minus 2 crosses the x-axis at one point in the interval from 0 to 1. What is the slope of the graph at this point? Well, the first thing I notice here is that, okay, we're on problem 78, which means we're in the calculator section, and I can put this function y equals e to the tangent of x minus 2 into the graphing calculator and look at the graph. So that's what I want to do here. So let's go ahead and begin. Let's go to y equals, and let's put in that e to the tangent of x. Close the parentheses, close the parentheses again, and then minus 2. Let's hit enter. Let's hit graph. And we're going to zoom in and get a little bit better picture of what's happening here. So let's go to zoom. And number 2, hit enter. Let's go ahead and pull that graph off to the screen. Now it says the graph of y equals e to the tangent of x minus 2 crosses the x-axis at one point in the interval from 0 to 1. So here's our interval from 0 to 1. And we see that it does, in fact, cross the axis at one place, the x-axis. And we want to find out what, first of all, that point's, that point's value is. Where does it cross? And the second is, what is the slope of the tangent line? So we're looking at what is the slope at that point. That's what we're trying to find out. So let's go to the calculator again. And we're going to find, we'll go to second and calculate, we're going to find the zero. That's first of all where it's crossing the axis. So go to number two and we'll be to the left side of the x-axis. Hit enter. We want to go to the right side after it already crosses in the right bound. Then hit enter and then bring it back a little bit somewhere where it's close and hit enter. I'm going to go ahead and pull this off to the screen. And we're going to notice that that value is x equals 0 0.6061193. All right, now I don't want to round anything at this point because I want an accurate answer. So let's go back to our calculator. And we want to find when what is the slope of the tangent line, which means we're looking for the first derivative. So let's go to second and calculate. And we see that number six gives us the first derivative. So we can use number six. But then we need to type in the point. And so we want 0 0.6061193. So that's what I'm going to type. Point six zero six. 11193 and hit enter. And we'll notice that we have the derivative, and I'll pull this off as well. Expand this so we can look at it. And so the derivative dy dx will equal 2.96. 0, 9, and it keeps going. And we want to round it to three decimal places, so I see that it's going to go to 2.961. All right, so that's going to be our first derivative, and that's representing the slope of the tangent line. And so let's look at our answer choices. 2.961 is letter D.